Hey guys, I'm Rose and welcome back to another episode of Bioshock Infinite. Where we last left off was we basically, uh, shoot. <laughs> we basically went through the third version of the world. This time we had the tools that Chen Lin used back at his factory. But unfortunately, heading back to Chen Lin, he died. Uh, but the Vox Populi are star starting to go up against Fink. And they actually have more gunpower and manpower for once to finally keep up with uh with think and his crew and the soldiers and stuff and apparently this ward is also where slate and dewitt had uh join voice join voices <laughs> jo join forces to take on the comstock so it seems like slate is not dead oh geez what's going on there's a lot of dead folks there of course there's no end to this fighting so far yet. So we're just gonna hopefully make our way through here, I guess. There's no way out. Oh I see. They took over those ships and used their own ships against them. Oh, there we go. Rockets are coming my way again. Every time. Why can't you guys kill something else? Kill somebody else. Oh, where? Oh, hi, buddy. I was not sure where the heck that guy was. I, I didn't know that guy was still alive for some reason. Alright, well, these are just the box popular allies. Again. Wow. Sheesh. Man, these guys are like. The box popular are like really like. vicious and like how they're trying to just like take down everything they can. <laughs> Kinda of crazy though. Um, carbine. Okay. It's really interesting too that they're glowing, glowing red a little bit. It's like there's light on them. Uh, we should head behind. Well, let's head forward, I guess. Yeah, let's head forward. Daisy said she was coming here for Fink. We need to take that elevator up. Bet uh, at least to Fink's office. I mean, honestly, Fink has been hiding all this time, so we're when revival is helpful. Okay. Like, Fink's been, like, quiet since we last went into this world, I guess I'd say. Hey, there's a lockpick over there. Where? Lockpick, where? Oh, there it is. Okay. The guy's bag has the lockpicks, a bunch of them, probably. Here, anything up on these like uh, stair-looking fountain thingy, mabobber? I don't even know. Bucking, bucking Bronco. I don't need it right now because I'm full on it. Yeah, that was pretty much it. Okay, cool. Let's get going. Come on, Elizabeth. Let's go. And boom. There we go. It's kind of strange how we're going up to Fink's office in the non-normal way. We're just going through his like little war-torn factory at this point, and it's incredibly crazy how we're going up to this in this particular fashion. Also, that's a lot of like stuff going on. Oh, jeez, machines! Oh, they even make the, the electricity generator stuff. I'm wondering how much what like this factory seems to be creating. They're just a lot. right for each other, aren't they? Who? It's Roy and Comstock. Yin and Yang, I guess. The Fitzroy and Comstock ideas, like they both Mayland? have. Mister Lin, my God, I, I was so set on getting to Paris. I, I didn't really think that. You couldn't have known this would happen. I had a role in this catastrophe. If if you want to pretend that we're purely innocents in this, then that's your prerogative, but... But... Oh, not again. Fink's gonna call us again. Okay, that sounded... The, the vending machine was playing an audio, and I was just like, what the hell? <laughs> um, hello? Fink? I saw you 
die, Booker. Easy. Saw with my own eyes. Fitzroy. Listen, I got you your guns. I'm here for my airship. But my Booker DeWitt died for the Vox Populi. You either an imposter or a ghost. Uh, my Booker DeWitt was a hero to the cause. A story to tell your children. You... You just complicate the narrative. And what is she gonna do now? Is she gonna tell them to turn against us, I guess, at this point? Oh god, don't tell me I have to kill these guys now. Yep, I have to kill them. Yep, because they turn red now, so that's why I was like, oh god, they're enemies now. I don't have anything. That's fine. I'm already, I already got rid of them all. This kind of sucks. It's like, you know, you could have just leave me be. Why am I a tool to your own... My god, dude. Like... Why is Daisy considering me as, like, a tool of her own, like, invention? It's not even, like, I'm not even, like... So that means Slate is dead, too, isn't it? If that's the case. Because determining on the fact that she's like, Oh, you should be dead. Uh, feels like... What's this? What is... Is another ability? What? <laughs> I can't remember this one because this one was also not likely used by anyone. Poseidon. Ew. Ooh, typophobia. Or trinophobia, whatever it is called. Fear of, like, multiple choruses and holes. Undertow. To wash away your enemy. <laughs> Hold to grab enemies and release to reel them in for punishment. Oh, I see. Okay. I mean, they're probably gonna tell us to use it for like whatever room that that this goes on to. So we'll do that after we check this room out. These holes have shown me yet another wonder, though I've yet to see the application for it. They illuminate a merger of machine and man that is somehow the lesser yet the greater of both parties. The process seems to be irreversible. <laughs> Perhaps, though, Comstock will have some need of this kind of thing to keep watch in that tower he is building. Wait, Comstock built a tower? I wonder. Oh, there's another, another thing here. Let me grab this. Spare the rod. 30% chance of melee becomes possessed. Oh. Ooh. That's really interesting. I haven't seen that one before. That's a really new one. I'm just grabbing free money that I can. Alright. Anything new? Ooh. Yeah. Dude. This is nice. Mm, what is this? Oh. Increases the float time. This one's like a chain one, yeah. And then there's chain electricity. Okay. And then... Oh, stun duration. Okay. Adds brief invulnerability on attack and recharges shield. Oh, dude. I want that. Okay. Because I actually like charge. It was a, It was not a bad... Want to hold uh, on to this? Sure. It was not bad, I guess, like to try and get like those things. Let's see. Oh, wow. There's a lot more here, too. Gosh, damn it. Uh, makes me wonder if I should. Oh, and increased damage on sniper rifle? Oh, dude. There's so many good upgrades and I can't spend them all. <laughs> I have to, like, take, give or take which one I can right now. Because I have to, like, get the ones with the abilities I want. Okay, what, what is the one thing I'm going to use the most of? And that is the weapons, of course. But I want to use the abilities a bit more, a little bit now, but it's just like I don't want to at the same time. Uh, you know what? I'll just take the damage, I guess. Okay, so I fully upgraded the shot, the sniper rifle now. Let's see if this upgrades the... Okay, that's fully upgraded that. So all the weapons here, this pistol, sniper rifle, and machine guns are now fully upgraded. Everything else has not been upgraded yet, so... It sucks, but at least we got two guns. Oh, we got achievements. Killed out and Grand Languise. Achievement unlocked. 
Fill down and uh, Renling Weiss. I think Renling Weiss is like spend a certain amount of money on like upgrades or using money rather and then uh, the killed out is probably maxing out one of the upgrades for the uh, maxing out one of the uh, weapon upgrades I guess Whew. oh that's where all the upgrades were coming from oh I'm a dumb dumb I was gonna be like I was like oh I don't have enough money now I do. Damn it! I could have saved it for the freaking. Ah, oh, that sucks. I didn't realize there was like a desk here in the back because I was not paying attention to the behind me when I was walking by here. <laughs> That's my fault. Damn it. Well, at least we can now spend it on other weapons that we need to upgrade. Uh, but who knows? There isn't a. There is a achievement for upgrading all the, all the up, uh, upgrade all the abilities to the max as well. I haven't been using Krill's, so I don't think I really want to use it right now. I do want to save for the uh, 1614 for the charge aid, though. Because it restores your shield when you use it. Need money? Oh, yes. yes Here. Yes, yes. What do you got? Ooh, but I need 300 more. Arg. You know what? Should I do this? Like, just upgrade the weapons again? What is this one again? Oh, volley gun. Hand cannon is like pretty good too because I haven't used it. But these choices are hard. It's like, do I want to upgrade to more weapons fully, or do I want to just stick with like saving for this vigor, vigor, vigor? Actually, can you? I don't think you can possess these things to drop money out of it. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think it's well worth trying trying it out because I think that they'll just lead to nothing anyways. Is there like a random salt sitting around here that I can just pick up? Shotgun ammo. Shotgun ammo. I'm wondering if there's like some other like salts around here, but I don't think there's any. Just realize there's like a backside to this. <laughs> oh. Nothing. Damn it. Maybe there's might be money around somewhere? Paint red, really? Red paint for some reason? Alright, uh, yeah, let's use the Poseidon thing, I think, or the flow away, whatever the ability is called. Got a so lock, it, needs picking. Let me have a look. Let's brush away the waters, or brush away the enemies here with the water. All done. Wait, you gave me the ability, but there's no example to use it on? Booker! What? What? I wasn't even going up yet. Excuse me? Elizabeth, why did you run up there? What? Why did Elizabeth just run up? I didn't even do anything. No. No, Fink? No. No. Oh, Fink. Ew. Kill the imposters. Burn their bodies when you're done. Oh gosh, we're gonna have to fight our way out of here, isn't it? Booker Fireman! Uh huh. Thanks. Thanks. Oh god. Oh jeez. Oh god. Oh jeez. I hate this so much. I can't even do much. Okay. Alright. I can't really do too much yet. Tesla coil? Open it. Done. Why the Tesla coil? I wonder. Come here. Lay it on him. Oh, there we go. We're good. Cool. We got our health back at least. What does this Tesla coil do? Oh, is it just this lock things out, I guess? I don't need the health yet. Bye. Have a beautiful time. Alright, let's go up there. I don't know what the hell I'm looking at either way. Oh, there's a thing in there. There's a thing in there, but I can't get in there, is it? Where are you? Where's this guy? Dang it. There's some RPG stuff. 
I hear it, but I don't know where he at. Where are they at? Where is Guy? This is so dumb. I hear him, but I can't see him. I don't know what they're doing. I'm just gonna do things like I normally would then. Get money! Ow! Where? Where are you? Where are they? Oh, there you are. Thank you. Bye-bye. Where is enemy? Please. Please stop running around. You piss me off. Where is enemy? Oh, more enemies behind me. Shut up. Oh, ow, 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 where, where? Oh. All this time I thought that was Elizabeth. All that time I thought that was Elizabeth. Ugh. Oh, jeez. Sorry, Elizabeth. We're in the way. We're in the wrong way. I don't need ammo. I need help. Okay, I need to go back to the. I need to go to the back side so I can pick up the medical kit because I did see a medical kit behind me. Ooh, 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 ooh. Got some health back at least, I'd say. Yeah. Uh, okay. Let me switch the water to something like charge or something. There we go. Yeah, I'm wondering. Oh, jeez, where? Next shot, I guess. Where are they? Medicine. Give me. Take this. Thank you. Nice. Where the hell are they? I can't see it. I'm getting shot at, but I can't see it. I can't see them because I don't know where they're at. Oh, there they are. How dare you, people! What? Are they brainwashing him? Brainwashing the thing? Oh jeez. Oh god. Oh, there you are. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> I'm not dead. Shut up. Ah, jeez. Here you go. Give me. Nice. Wow, that's one of. Oh, jeez. What? That is hilarious. Oh, jeez. I'm running. Oh, god. That was bad. Oh, that was tough. Hi. Ooh. I'm sorry if I couldn't speak a lot in that moment. There was just so much going on at that point. Also, why the heck is this sitting in the middle of the air like that? Alright, we got some ammo back, I guess. Alright, cool. Man, that was a lot of intense, like, moments there. It's just like... Gosh, seriously. It's like really intense for no reason. Alright. Can we go back in? Oh no, we can't. We are locked out. Jeez. Okay. I did see the infusion one, like the little thing that gives us upgrades up here. Sorry, Fink, we couldn't save your ass, but also he kind of didn't deserve. Oh no, no, no! Wait, is that the boy? He's going to kill that child. Okay, we have to do something. We have to act. We have to get in there. How? Come on, Booker. We've, we've got to get out of here. Boost me up. Really? Oh my god. I do want to get this thing, but I don't know how we're going to get in there to that. Let's get that. But... Alright, Elizabeth. Let's do it. I got no other choice because there's nothing else around here to Go really to the do. window and distract Daisy. Go! Distract Daisy. Let's go. Daisy? Hello? Is this it? Is this your movement, Daisy? This is what needs to be done. You see, the founders ain't nothing but weeds. Cut them down and they just grow back. 
If you want to get rid of the weed, you got to pull it up from the root. It's the only way to be... Oh. Is that Elizabeth? Oh, it was. Elizabeth. I guess it runs in the family. Also, why did the light, like, just suddenly turn on in here? I had to comfort her, it seems. Elizabeth. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, easy. Drop the, drop the, the scissors, drop it. I'm gonna get this infusion at least before, before it's too late on me again. <laughs> Wanna at least get nice. that. Oh, he had a, he had a voxophone, really? That's weird. Oh, this is the you win this full war. You send this to New York. <laughs> they ain't getting the girl. Whoever they are. <clears throat> Maybe I did right by you and the Vox. But in the end, they don't square anything. Anna. Anna. I'm sorry. Yeah. Interesting. They had like DeWitt's last words before he died in this particular, in this particular uh, world. Wait, Elizabeth is running, I guess. This is where I'm just like, why are we? Why? Oh, I guess this makes sense actually, because as her character is like not used to killing anybody, it's like it's like a little bit more harder for her to face the reality that she actually killed Daisy. Oh, this is the ship that we were on with the uh, with the first lady. They turned it into like a medical center in a weird way, though. Is it? I know how this feels. What are you doing in there? <laughs> That's it. That's the end of the knock, I guess. I I pressed it three times. It seems like it, <laughs> it just stops there. Alright. I don't think this is gonna end up good, but we'll try. Oh, achievement. Working class heroes. Achievement unlocked. Are we headed to New York or are we or are we headed to Paris? <laughs> per per her request of uh, Paris. Oh what the Elizabeth. That was fast. Elizabeth cut her hair. This and is all I things? had. Listen. How do you do it? How do I do what? Forget. How do you wash away the things that you've done? You don't. You just learn to live with it. So the moment of truth between us. New York or Paris? Oh jeez, it's a uh, songbird. No, 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 no. Oh, shit. It's going to destroy we this find thing. A way to make this thing go faster. No, we can't. How the hell would you make this thing go faster? I don't get it. Also, she dresses somewhat similar to Lady Comstock. It's really weird. There's got to be some sort of some sort of throttle no. or accelerator. Do you know something. what that looks like? I don't know. Help me find it. <gasps> oh gosh. Elizabeth. <laughs> All right. Whoa. I wonder where we would crash land. Is. 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 Try again. All right. Hold on. Here you are. What? Those kids are here at the weirdest time, honestly. Booker, we've got to stop them. No, that's the E. No, that is so Booker, hurry. It. No, it's not. It is. Isn't. Is. Isn't. Is. If they play the whole again. song, no, he'll come try. back. Fine. Hurry, Booker, hurry. Hmm. No, come on. Is. 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 is not. Is. Is not. Is not. Is. Pay attention. I'm sorry, I'm just listening into their playing no, of the music. Certain? Quite certain. That's the E. It is. It's wrong, though. Also, there's no music because I turned off music, as I said before. So the, there's no music playing when they're playing it. I'm just watching them be like weird over there. 
Honestly, I just don't get why you have to keep bringing them back. They just don't really serve much of a purpose besides being distractors, I guess. Here. I feel like the the, the brother sister duel are like very like distracting. Stop it! Stop Fine. it! You don't know Here what you're are. doing. Huh? There it is. No. You've done it now. He's he's coming back. He's coming back. The notes were correct. The instrument was not. One needs both to get his attention. But if you know how to sing to him, he will take you where you need to go. What? Oh, you mean the songbird is... Would you care to hear anything else, brother? Perhaps a waltz? Uh, okay, I guess. Who are you? We are where we are needed. And needed where we are. So Comstock uses these songs. Are there others we can use? Something to keep the bird off our back? Perhaps you should ask the maestro himself. So where is he? Gone. <sighs> of course. Well, at least they left the piano. <laughs> Elizabeth's face. Oh, what, what did I just saw there? Oh, this is like, uh, I don't know. Alright, let's move. <laughs> funny because Elizabeth's faith is, face is like, what the hell Look, did I just witness? That's Comstock House. If we're gonna find him, we should start there. The box are coming! We need to leave the dock! We need to push off immediately! The box are coming! Oh, these are just innocent folks who are trying to get out of here. Where are these people going? Wherever the Vox Populi ain't. Yep. Why are they so, like, panicky about, like... They're all like so panicky about like leaving. You need to remove your belongings or we can't take any more people. Wow. The barge is full. You're going to have to remove some of your luggage if we're going to pick more people off deck. Yeah, it's either to get more people or less luggage. That's how it goes. Found some money. Thank you. Okay, catch. Hopefully we'll find the Vigor vending machine eventually, because I really want to get the stuff I need for like upgrading the charge charge stuff even though I might not use the charge forever I feel like eventually I'll just quit using the charge and I'll be like oh that was a waste of money <laughs> I'll be like sad this place looks really interesting but I do hear a lot of shots I think like a lot of gun shooting at the same time I'm wondering what's gonna happen because Daisy did die because of uh Like, Daisy did die because of the uh, Elizabeth stabbing her, so... She did get left behind to die at that point. The barge is at full weight! We're taking off now! Disembark! Interesting. So all the folks are just leaving their luggage behind because they can't really afford to... carry that much weight. Which is fair, I think. For the most part, it's like a fair thing to do because they don't really have much they can do with like what they got. What do you got, rich boy? Huh? Come on! All right. Well, I wanted to get some money. Uh, not what I wanted. I just wanted to pick up the money. Give me. Thank you. Alright, we got we got what we needed here. Let's keep let's keep on shooting. He's got a flat cannon! Where? Oh there. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Do it now. Nope. Sheesh. Okay, well that thing is flying away anyway. That's one. Oh, jeez. I didn't even know you were here. Thank you. Appreciate it. Thank you. Oh, jeez. I gotta, like, be careful here. It's not easy. Go ahead. Get it again. Oh, jeez. Oh, oh, no, no, no. 
keep doing that where I'm like... Alright. Sheesh. Alright, let me switch it up. Ah. Uh. Oh gosh. I'm trying to like shoot at him, but I can't. Can't forever. Ugh. Got some health, I guess. Alright. Here we go. There we go. Get him. Get it. Get it open. Sheesh. Patch yourself up. Oh, thank you. Sheesh. That was like at the right time too. I know I can use my sniper rifle, but I want to try to use. Screw it. I'm gonna use it. Get the cover. God dang it. These guys are just so annoying. <laughs> just, just like... Okay, that thing is not... Apparently not hitting anything much. That's weird. Alright, we're gonna have to use our handgun. Or hand cannons here. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, whoa, whoa. These are like innocent folks who just died. What the heck? Come on. No, you don't. What is this? Oh, water puddle. I could have used the water puddle for the electricity. I guess I didn't do that. I wasn't thinking about it. Oh, sheesh. Yeah, there's some innocent folks who are just dying because of the fact that these Vox Populi want something. I don't know. Like, the Vox Populators are just so weird. Like, awkwardly lost in a way, I think. Like, it, like, it feels like they have sense of purpose at first, but now they kind of don't have sense of purpose besides causing mayhem. Or causing, like, terror, I guess. While Comstock is, like, trying to bring peace in a way. It just it makes me wonder why that... That why why we're seeing like so much of a juxtaposition between the two uh, groups this so one. much. Do you think he wanted to be a part of this? No, obviously. Did you? But yeah, it's like a weird juxtaposition of like everybody like having their own goals, but then like it's like the big the big baddies getting the more power here at this point because we are making these mistakes or choices for them. We're making the choices, and we're changing. We're, we're changing the course of uh, of society, basically, of Colombia, which is an interesting thing to look at, I guess. But in a weird way, like the terrors and the the destruction of peace is like caused because we want, you know, an out. We want the character to have an out, an outing to get out of here. But every time they want us, every time they let us get out, almost they pull us right back in because they feel like they <laughs> need to like continue the story. It's like I guess it's kind of like a story that always wants to be finished, but doesn't let the player decide when it should be finished. It seems right up your alley. Keep yep. a lookout. What is it about that song that brings in the bird? It always has. When I was younger, I used to be excited when I heard it. Excited? He was all I had. He fed me. Brought me books. He was my friend. Friend? Until I grew up. And I hated him. Because he was my warden. But he's just Comstock's pet, isn't he? Just like me. Done. All right. Port Prosperity. What is this? Is that just... Oh my god. Look at this. Oh. Fitzroy is no better than Comstock. Was she? Uh, once people get their blood up, it ain't easy to settle it down again. I think this those... is in our hands, isn't it? Yeah. 
So it's partly our fault at the same time. At the same time, I think those are like the scalps. Ugh, the scalps of the people's head. The ladies' heads, I guess. Alright, I haven't really gotten to any saving point, but we'll have to end it here. For, for, with some unfortunate news that we have to end it here for now. Oh wait, I should have- Ah, uh, I shouldn't have not picked up that salt until after- Until I used the possession here. Oh well. It's my fault. Hold on to this. Thank you. Thank you kindly. Alright. Yeah, we're gonna end it here for now. I'll probably upgrade the stuff in the next episode. Uh, okay, so this is to head forward. Okay, I wanted to not go forward yet. I wanted to pick up the remaining stuff here. So we'll we'll use the lockpicks here and we'll pick up the vigors and stuff like that in the next episode. So thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode whenever you mind. So hope you guys have a great amazing day. We good night or whatever for watching this. In the next episode, let's go ahead and uh, explore the red... Uh, this this place called the Port of Prosperity or Port Prosperity and uh, see where it takes us. I really don't know where, where our next goal is besides playing the song to get the songbird to get us back out of here. But even then that feels kind of weird of a goal, I guess. I don't know. So far it's been like, the flow is get the girl, get out using the blimp, and then help the Vox Populi. And then Vox Populi becomes enemy but we need we but we want to still get out again but this time without the songbird getting in our way so it's kind of like i feel like these tears are just excuses to build the story in a way that the developers want it in a way like or the writer i guess the develop the writers who wants it to make the story seem naturally flowed in is using this like tear parallel universe colliding of worlds together kind of thing to excuse themselves to write the stuff i don't know i don't think it's a bad thing per se like the writing is okay with it but it's like it's kind of messy and that's what i said before like a few episodes ago it's like that's where i feel like there's this messiness of like inherent messiness of like the writing because it felt like a lot of it just feels too convenient for the writing to say hey like i'm pretty sure down the line like maybe a few episodes from now or yeah a few episodes from now we'll see daisy Fitzroy alive again because we went through another tear but this time daisy's alive and she's willing to take us down one one last time or something like that or get a chance to get get her revenge on us or something um i don't know i just feel like it's just weird to just like like insert convenience of like doing the parallel universe thing just to prove a point that the world is a messy place or something like that i just don't know i just feel like it's just too messy of a story at this point where the goal is so muddled with like so many inconveniences excusable inexcusable inconveniences and like it doesn't take you into places that make sense i guess like the flow feels kind of snappy uh in terms of the story i think the levels are great though like nonetheless like the level flows right into each other and that's beautiful about that that's the beauty the beauty of that but the problem is just the story isn't coherently putting it into place where it's just like why are we needing to be here i think that's the big problem is like every time we meet uh make it to a new location why are we here and the why are we here is written in a way that's like oh because our blimps destroyed we fly off and we land somewhere else or oh because some group or faction wants our help but they're doing it in terms of like trading with each other so it's just i don't know and then even then like the original part was like Daisy would promise to give us the ship if we get Chen Lin to back to the factory thing. But then it's like that gets kind of wiped out because of the fact that we're in a third version of the world. It's just like, what? Why? Why does that get forgotten? Why is that getting erased for just some excuse of saying the tear erased that sort of like memory of hers or something and that and that Booker DeWitt's different somehow like I feel like it just covers that sort of like excuse of like oh yeah just forget about that idea that now now we're in a new idea of what's going on with this world it's just like I get that it's again parallel universe but it's just like it's a little bit hard to keep up with and then eventually it's gonna be like five worlds into like whatever scenario we were in and like it's so muddled to the point where it's just like why 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 like this why like that but i think that it's just the concept works just the writing is hard to kind of make it work i think the execution's hard for this point 
at the uh, at this point of the junction of what I'm seeing. Anyways, other than that, that's it for this episode. So I'll see you guys in the next one. Roz, out. Ah.